Mr. Wise. And these are our dream tour lineups. I would love it if we got to open up for Daft Punk because I love their music and I think it would be really cool to play with robots. I would love to be on a tour that would never happen where John Coltrane opened for the Red Hot Chili Peppers in 91. I don't know anyone else who would want to see that, but me, I would love it. Okay. okay. I was also going to say Red Hot Chili Peppers. Ooh, get stole it. But Red Hot Chili Peppers, Blood Sugar Sex Magic Tour with the Rolling Stones as headlines. Okay, I was gonna. I had an idea, but uh, I was just told not to say that idea because I was gonna take the person's idea That's next to me. a good thing. Me. No, you can take uh, the idea. No, no, I'll take a different idea. Um, my <laughs> dream I, tour. Can, okay. I know what it's gonna be. What is it? Police and Blink 182. Yeah, that was gonna be it. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then, and then I could fill in, and I would get Stuart Copeland a little bit sick, where he would have to, he would have to cancel the show, and I'd fill in. That would be right. Right. Hey, tough yeah. 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 Um, I think a collective dream tour would probably be No Doubt. Yeah. They got back together. That band oh, was just that's such a, great, a huge I should have had that one. to us. Why didn't I think of that one? Or Paramore or Aretha Franklin. But that's me and Jesse's side project that yeah, will yeah. open for Aretha. <laughs> I just want to open up for Sam <laughs> Cooke. You know, then like yeah. direct support would be Ella Fitzgerald yes. and Louis Armstrong. And, and then, Billie Holiday. Yeah, and then, yeah, maybe Billie Holiday would do like a few special guests and we would, you know, be first of three. Yeah. I thought we could learn a lot. It's a big lineup. Yeah. <laughs> you know, doors open at seven. <laughs>